you've tried to see a new doctor or a specialist, chances are you've been told it is going to be a while. Yeah, we've all been there. Darlene Melendez asked KOAT UNM health expert Dr. Ash why that is and what's being done about it. Unfortunately, New Mexico doesn't have enough health care providers. The state has short hundreds of primary care providers and dentists, according to the latest numbers from the U.S. Department of Health and Human Services. There's also a shortage of mental health providers, and the New Mexico Hospital Association reports our state needs 6,000 more nurses. You know, compounding this problem, rural hospitals have trouble recruiting and retaining health care workers, leaving hospitals in the inner city extremely at overcapacity. Making that wait list so long, Dr. Ash, what is being done to shore up this health care provider gap? Thanks. You know, as a faculty member at UNM School of Medicine, I can tell you how UNM is working to close that gap. Recent data shows about 50% of UNM's medical doctor graduates practice in New Mexico. 70% of College of Nursing graduates stay in the state. But you know, that's still not enough to meet New Mexico's health care needs. Albuquerque hospitals are competing for the best workers with Denver, Phoenix, El Paso, and other cities in our region. Some of the things UNM and other hospitals are doing, they're supporting the state's efforts to expand broadband to allow for more telehealth options and encouraging the state to support the next generation of healthcare providers.